Alright, who wants to try that again, mate? Na 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 na. Oh yeah, while well, I was playing down the first time, I noticed a little secret place. Like, oh, here it is! Well, I was gonna take guess that'll lead me to that spatula I was trying to grab. Or was that a sock? I never really did know. Ugh. Oh. Uh, can we even reach that? Huh. G give, me, give me a sec, give me a sec. So, that is a spatula up there, right? But there doesn't appear to be any way up there. So, I'm gonna take a guess we really need to make a leap of faith. I am not gonna love this at all. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I might try to get 100% as far as spatulas go. But don't but no guarantees, it's a blind let's play. Don't expect to get for me to get hundred percent in one go. But the way I roll is I get the stuff I can. I'm gonna try and get this one spatula. It looks like quite a challenge actually. Kinda make quite a difficult jump to get it! What if we can jump like I wonder if I can jump after sliding off the edge or something. Pretty cool, um, sliding music, I guess. I wonder if this game will actually have any sliding stages like in the first one, because those are pretty cool. Alright, maybe one or two more goes, then I'm gonna come back for it later off screen or something. Unless there's something I'm just not doing right. Which, that's probably it, because that's how blind, blind games are, when you're playing it blindly and whatnot. Oh! Oh, it was a sock. Oh well, I don't care. I said I was gonna try and go for 100%, so either way, right? That, which means no collectibles pointless, especially the point. Huh? What? Oh, it's a generator thing! Above the generator thingies. So, is this like a mini boss fight or something? I'm gonna guess this is mini boss music and we're supposed to destroy all these generators. In that case, destroy generators, I shall. Or maybe we're just supposed to hit all these switches. Either way, let's go for it. Oh, that almost killed me. You're gonna die, and I'm gonna hit the switch. Thank you for the health. But I must be for Krabby Patties' as health, not underwear, thanks. Are these platforms gonna collapse or something? Huh. They actually look like the platforms that would collapse. Alright, by that done with. Many boss defeated. Now, a new path open. Oh, Patrick's there. Wonder if I actually get to control him. Spongebob! Woo! That's gonna be your taste, Patrick. Well, of course, Spongebob! What would I do? Cause you're always getting in trouble. Well, the robots and the... Oh yeah, I found this place. I don't know what it is, but it looks like... Ooh, Spatula! 100 points to anyone who gets a reference. Hit one of the games I Let's Play. Second hit by Rare Rare. Third hit, Donkey Kong 64. Don't! Not to sell. Stop giving out hits. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. Oh, we're playing as Patrick. Cool. Well, that means we can go back and do that one that one thing with uh, freezing the water. 
Uh, I'll do that later. Oh. A throw of fruit. Petra can pick up fruit and... Robots. Da -da 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 -da. Huh. I'm pretty sure it was the Y button for the first game, but in this case, it's X. Huh. Oh, I see the... Okay, they got rid of Patrick's spin attack and put in this belly attack. That sucks in a way. I must prefer the spin attack. Throw tiki's, yeah, 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 yeah. He can throw... Yeah, he can do that in the first game, so he should be able to do it here. Oh, he can ground pound just like the first game. Cool. Well, are you gonna let me pick it up or what? Whatever. Oh, I was supposed to pick it up after I broke the other thingy. A bus stop. You may switch between... Ah, oh, just like the, uh, the porta potty. I think I prefer the bus stop over the porta potty thingy. Perhaps you can throw fruit up steps, then climb up the steps, blah, 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 yeah, yeah. Before it will, just like the first game. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Huh? Ah, oh. oh, the good old jellyfish. He's wonderful have to fight a, another jellyfish like from the first game. That was hell. Huh, do we need a switch? Nah, whatever. <laughs> I like the whole transition thingy. And we can attack townspeople just like in Sonic and Mario. The Patrick Teeter totter that only Patrick can use! Hi, huh, Patrick's best friend. Da -da 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 -da. Well, ain't that convenient? Only Patrick can use it! Figured that was gonna happen. But there must be some reason for us having to switch to SpongeBob. Huh. Well, I guess we'll figure out later on, won't we? Alright, let's uh, try out the steer tire thing. It actually looks pretty fun. Let's try it out. Whee! Yep, that is pretty fun. <laughs> Man, it wasn't the first game. A Thunder Tiki. When Pat does it, he'll begin to storm after a few seconds to go boom. Don't be near when it goes boom. Oh, I get it. It's, a, it's like one of those powder cakes from the first game. That's pretty cool. They always give me a lot of points. Yeah, yeah, he can throw, just like in the first game, but it'll blow up, so be careful. Oh, I know where this is going. Of course, when you, when you destroy them, when you destroy them, like, physically or whatever, um, you won't have any time to run away, since Patrick has that useless belly attack. <laughs> so they... I guess the only reason I had that belly attack was because we weren't trying to run away from destroying it physically or something. Hey, you particle head! Watch where you're going! Uh. He's talking to me. Oh, my hero! I am at your command! He's pointing, you idiot! Come here, you big pink Alex! Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? That's like the first game. Oh, so very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday. And then I'm not Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into the <laughs> cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the cave, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the jump bucket. Alright then, I think I can live with that. Well then, will you vaporize me? I might spare your leg so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low quality design and knock off wallets. Like in that one episode with, uh, oh, fry cooking Olympic or whatever. Patrick, you do not want to be- <sighs> Never mind, you're such an idiot. Hell, number four of the kids next door is smarter than you, Patrick. He actually knows that no means no. Not yes, you retard. We jump on the air and... Yes! I already discovered Patrick at Ground Pound by accident. 
Looks like the first game. And what the hell is with these rockets we're seeing around here? We'll find out, won't we? And what's with this toilet paper? Ugh, so many questions. 